I am doing today. Today is March 4th, 2024, and the topic is Children of Light. Let us pray. Father, in Jesus' name, Father, we thank you for the faithfulness of our life. We thank you for making us to see another new day where your name, by the exalted and glorified in Jesus' name. We pray that hand away everything against your time shall be glory. Father, please have mercy on us in Jesus' name. As we'll be learning your word this time, Father, please grant us understanding of your word. Help us, O oh Lord, to be the doers of your word, but not just the hearers. Help us, O oh Lord, to apply the word of God in our daily life in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name, I've prayed. Amen. As I said before, the topic is children of light. And the text is taken from Ephesians chapter 5, verse 1 to 10. And verse 8 of Ephesians chapter 5, verse 1 to 10. Apostle Paul said that we were once in darkness, but now we are in the light and the, the what we are light in the Lord. So when we are light in the Lord, we walk in as children of the light and we should and in verse 10 he also said finding out what is acceptable up to the lord so we should always walk as children of light and find out what is acceptable to the lord we should be clean we should not be a fornicator we should not do things against the will of a of God, but we should do things that bring glory unto God. And the memory verse is taken from Isaiah chapter 6 to verse 1, which says, Arise, shine, for your light has come. The glory of the Lord is risen upon you. The message as a child of God, we have to continually live in our lives as ch children of light. And how can we continue to live our life as children of light? We can be an example unto others in words, thoughts, and actions, the way we think, the way we behave, the way we speak, we can be a good example to others. In this world of darkness, that all unrighteous things look normal, like abnormal things look normal in this kind of world we have even in the world of darkness we children of god is the bible the world are reading we have to keep the good work going so that our heavenly father can be glorified keep on doing good things so that our father which is in heaven can be glorified we'll be going on a short break please stay tuned we'll be right back Excellent and successful. I'm for Christ. I will live for Him. I will fulfill destiny. Welcome back. Darkness is anything you are doing, saying, reading, and thinking that you don't want people around you to see or be aware of. I'll repeat that. I'll say that again. Darkness is anything you are doing saying reading and thinking that you don't want people around you to see or be aware of as children of light we should stop it so that so as not to bring the wrath of god upon us we can find that more in ephesians chapter 5 verse 3 and verse 4 we should not associate with darkness but rather bring them to light we can find that in ephesians chapter 5 verse 11 People are in a dark world and they know that they are in dark world. So they're trying to bring people into dark world. But what we should do is that we should not associate with them. We should stay far away from them, uh, but rather bring them into light. To do this, we must be sure we are doing what is in Ephesians chapter 5, verse 17 to 21, which is... We should not walk as fools, but we should be wise. We should sing and make melody in her heart to the Lord and always give thanks unto God, submitting to one another in the fear of God. Are you ready to shine the light? We should be children of light. We should walk as children of light. 
we should do things that will bring glory to God. Matthew chapter 5 verse 16 says, Let your light so shine out before men that they may see your good works and glorify your Father which is in heaven. Let people around you see good works you are doing so that they can glorify your heavenly Father which is in heaven. Your heavenly father your father which is in heaven the scripture that truth darkness cannot withstand light let's pray this prayer point heavenly father please make me her real light in jesus name amen father we thank you for the word we've heard this time where your name is exalted and glorified in jesus name for this is the day you have made and we shall rejoice and be glad in it in the name of jesus Father, please direct our steps, Lord. We commit our ways into your hands today. Father, please take absolute control. Help us, Lord, in everything we are doing. And today we shall shine. We shall shine in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name I pray. Amen. Hope you learned something today. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Bye. Young and talented, and successful.